good morning. Today we are getting our greenhouse. Uh, we've been wanting a greenhouse for a little while and uh, just to keep uh, keep food growing year round in the winter, and just uh, not be so limited out to the, the planting seasons. So we have that coming today. We're gonna get that started. We're very excited about it. We've had a lot of stuff going on this past week. We've primarily been focused outside um, versus inside taking a little bit of a break just because it's so tiring to work on the inside of the house all the time so just focusing on the outside we got a park delivered for Levi and the kiddos so that they can play outside and not be so constrained there's a lot of dangerous things on the land right now still a lot of exposed rocks and branches that are sticking up with sharp edges that we're just trying to focus on cleaning up and you know the land is so big that it just takes a lot of time so we now have a dedicated cleaned out area in the backyard where Levi can run around and get some exercise and, and just play and have a good time and not be constantly told no you can't go here or walk you can't do that so very excited about that he's just been having a blast every morning going out and playing on his park and uh, this past week we put together a back deck I didn't film it just because you guys already saw us put on a front deck. It's essentially the same thing, just on the back. So I'll show you a video of that here in a bit. And in the meantime, we're gonna keep clearing out a spot right now where the greenhouse is gonna go. And hopefully a good, I'd say 20 by 20 area uh, that we found in the woods where the soil is actually really fertile, um, where we're gonna intend on growing some corn right next to the greenhouse. So we got a lot of stuff going on today. I'm excited to show you everything that's happened the past week and what we got going on today. So stay tuned and you will see everything that's been going on. Now this guy over here, we actually built, oh, I don't know, about a week or so ago. And what it is, is it's just PVC pipe with drilled holes in it. And uh, Levi just has a ton of fun with that. You kick that on and it starts to, starts to spray, spray water and it's better than a sprinkler. Wish I had one of these when I was a kid because this thing was just really cool. So I'll show you how that works here. I'm just gonna come and pull the pull the hydrant on. And there it comes. Look at that. Put a nice little mat on the ground so Esther can crawl around and this thing is cool. I even made a little doorway, a little spot right here. It has no water spraying out so you can get in without getting wet. And all that is is half inch PVC pipe with drilled holes. And you'd be surprised how much fun the kiddos can have with that. So I think the total cost of building that was like 10 or 15 bucks. I already had some PVC glue so I guess if you get PVC glue it'll cost a little bit more but uh, yeah that was a really good investment because they're just having so much fun with it so one of the other small things we did a while ago I did a video on carrying out uh, Wi-Fi to the metal building and it turns out that my router it was it's not very good I only paid 30 bucks for it it was working really good for a week or so and then uh, it uh, just kind of dropped out so we carried an ethernet line from the house to the well house and now I've got much better internet so we've just been so busy and uh, speaking of being busy it looks like portable building mall has just shown up with the greenhouse so that's quite exciting and here it is Coming down the drive. Wow, that thing is beautiful. Look at that thing.
houses here. We did not get near as far as we wanted to on the cornfield over there. Mini cornfield, I shouldn't even call it a cornfield, but <laughs> we didn't get as far as we wanted to on that. Uh, so hopefully tomorrow we'll be plugging away at that. Looks like we're gonna be renting a rototiller, rototill, and um, get the ground nice and ready and uh, a little bit more work to do and we should be planting corn in the ground and in the meantime we're gonna go buy a bunch of stuff for the greenhouse and hopefully try our luck inside this very nice greenhouse. So we are working on the garden that we're gonna put next to the greenhouse today hoping to plant some corn maybe some potatoes a couple of other things in it but we rented a rototiller for the day and we are currently prepping the spot where we're gonna put the garden and uh, hopefully we'll have some nice soil by the time we're done. Looks like dad's having a lot of fun over there. Oh, he's just going. Have to be careful, he said he saw a snake over there earlier. Anyway, as soon as we uh, get this done, then we will start prepping to plant some corn and a bunch of other vegetables. Well, it's been a long day of work, but we got the garden roto tilled, and we have about nine rows that we uh, put in the garden with a variety of plants. We have, uh, well, we have corn, we have green beans, we have cucumber, garlic, potatoes, broccoli, asparagus, and uh, I think that's it. So got it it's actually starting to look like a homestead now and uh, I'm proud of it so we'll see what happens shade right now resting uh, it's like our gardens looking pretty good if you want to see how that garden looks what we have uh, coming up later this year and watch it all the way through harvest hit that subscribe button and follow us as we make this homestead as good as it can be we'll see you next time <laughs>